Are you getting ES Ports FC25 error code CE-108255-1? Then you are at the right place. We have got some easy ways to do that. Welcome back to Silicophilic, your go-to source for tech tips and fixes. Method 1. Restart the game. If you're getting error CE-108255-1, while playing FC25 on PS4 or PS5, press the PS button on the controller. This should lead to the PlayStation home screen. The game's icon should now be highlighted but not chosen. Press the Options button on your controller. Choose Close Application and next select OK. Close the EA FC25 game on your PC, PS5 or Xbox console. Method 2. Power cycle the gaming console. Next, you can power cycle the console and then relaunch the game. Sometimes the cache data may get corrupted and result in PS console errors. So, power cycle the console to get rid of the cache. To do that, hold the power button of the console for a few seconds till it completely turns off. Once the controller is off, release the power button and unplug it from the main power source. Wait for a minute, then plug it back in and restart the console. Method 3. Use the web app and create a new squad. Next, you can use the FC web app and create a new squad. For this, go to the FC web page and log into the FC web app. Ensure the game is still closed and then click on the login option on the FC web app. On the left hand side of the FC web app, click on squads. Click on create and name your new squad as desired. Go back to squad management, then select the new squad. Then click on set active to make it your active squad. Method 4. Delete old squads. The next step you can do is delete the old squads. Navigate to the squad management section, then select the old squads and click delete. Confirm that you want to delete the old squads. Method 5. Log out of the FC web app. After deleting the old squads, log out of the FC web app. For this, go to the bottom left side and click on settings. Click on the sign out to log out of the FC web app. Allow another 15 to 20 minutes before launching the game again. Open the game and check if the issue is resolved. Method 6. Turn off HDCP. If the issue persists, disable the HDCP on your PS console. Open settings on your PlayStation console. Then navigate to system then select HDMI. Now you should find the option to disable or enable HDCP. Now, if the HDCP is turned on, turn it off and check if this works for you. Method 7. Update the game. When you start a game or app, it automatically updates to the newest version available. But you can check for the game updates following these steps. Highlight the FC25 thumbnail in your game's home screen and press the Options button. Select Check for Update. If an update is available, install the update following the on-screen instructions. Method 8. Update the console. If your gaming console is outdated, then also you may see errors while gaming. So, download and install the latest updates via Safe Mode. Safe Mode enables you to perform some basic operations and fix the issues. Press the power button on your console and turn the device off. Again, press and hold the power switch until you hear two consecutive beeps. Use a USB cable to connect the console and the controller. You need to press the PS button on the PlayStation controller. Now this will take the PS to safe mode. Click on the Update System Software option from the safe mode and let the process get finished. Restart the console and relaunch the game. Now you should not get the error. Method 9. Unplug external devices. Disconnect any external devices connected to your console or computer. These devices can also cause interference and trigger errors. Once you disconnect the devices, you can reconnect them one by one and then launch the game again to check each time to find out which device is causing the error. Method 10. Use wireless controller. 
Sometimes using a wired controller can cause interference or connection issues that might lead to game errors. By using the controller wirelessly, you eliminate potential problems that might arise from faulty or unstable USB connections. This method can help ensure a more stable and consistent connection between your controller and the gaming console or PC, reducing the likelihood of encountering game errors. Method 11 Contact PlayStation Support Team If none of the methods shown could fix the error, you can contact the PlayStation Support Team. Type your problem and follow the on-screen instructions provided by the team to fix the issue. And there you have it. The methods to fix error code C1082551 in EAFC25 on PS4 and PS5. We hope one of the methods have worked for you. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and troubleshooting guides. Leave a comment and help others know which solutions help you to fix this issue. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video.